Jerry. At 55 years old, Vance, he's the oldest athlete ever to compete in the city finals. And now he's got it for the top 15 in a spot in Las Vegas. And up next, the dreaded tilting slider. This obstacle took out 51 people in qualifying. It's a five-foot swing, you know, but the hard part is being able to grab the pole and stick the landing. here on the spinning log. Hi, and welcome back to my channel. Um, today is going to be a kind of get ready with me, um, you know, video, a little kind of chit chat. Um, I've already have, you know, put on most of my makeup, so basically it's going to be an eye look, you know, and the finishing touches, so, um... Yeah, let's get into it. But before I get into this, I would like to thank all of my subscribers and welcome my new subscribers to my channel. I thank you for all of your support. Um, this is, you know, my I see my baby growing. <laughs> And it's like, you know, watching one of my children grow. And I'm so excited about this. And um, I really hope to bring um, new content in and um, some other things that, you know, I'm, I'm working on. So once again, I welcome my new subscribers and... I thank you all for all of your support. So, um, in the end, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a big thumbs up. Um, if you have not subscribed, I hope that you would subscribe because that would allow you to know, um, when I do upload, you know, videos and it will, you know, kind of get us you know, to get to know one another, as well as if, you know, you have any comments, leave them in the comment section, and I will be sure to get to them, and, um, yeah, and, you know, share this video, share it with your friends, your girlfriends, your family, um, anybody who's, you know, really into, makeup and in beauty so um once again you know i i thank you so we're gonna get into this video because i do not want this to be a long video but um yeah so let's get into it um today i will be using um the missy lynn palette um, by BH Cosmetics, and, um, this is what the palette looks like, this is what the palette looks like, and, um, I'm not sure what colors I'm going to be using, I'm just going to kind of wing it and everything, so, um, yeah, I've already um, put on my eye primer, which was the Urban Decay um, eyeshadow potion in anti-aging. And um, I think I'm going to use a base, which is going to be the MAC Paint Pot Painterly. So, um, what I'm going to do, I'm going to, um, bring you in closer so that you can see what I'm doing. So, 
Um, I think that's good enough. So, um, yeah, let's get started. Okay, um, I'm going to use, um, uh-oh, painterly as a base. As I said, I really, um, don't know where I want to, um, go with this. Yeah, I would um, really like to thank you all once again for supporting me. And most importantly, I would like to thank my friend Teresa, um, who many of you are subscribed to, um, for helping me and being my cheerleader and her channel uh -oh, her channel is um 50 plus 2013 and I would leave I'm going to leave um a link to her channel in the description box you know please you know check out her channel um show her some love i really love her um like i said she has been really been a supporter for me and been in my corner and wanting to help me succeed and I appreciate everything that she has done. Okay, I'm going to start out with this um, rusty shade right here and I'm going to put that in the crease using um, a fluffy brush and this is going to be my transition shade. Now, um, of course, one thing that you you want to do with um, any eye look is that you want to um, make sure you blend you know blend out your eyeshadows and that is what I'm doing. And as you can see, it's, you know, pretty much in my crease. So. And using a fluffy brush helps to disperse the shadow. You know, um, instead of concentrating it on pretty much one area, it helps to, um disperse the shadow. Now, um, what I'm going to do is use this purple right here to deepen the crease.
and I don't want to disperse it, you know, as wide as I did with the transition shade. I want to really concentrate this in the crease. And so I am using, um, I'm holding the brush like this, not like this. I'm holding it like this so and that allows me to really concentrate that color you know into the crease So what is going on with you all today? You know, I'm I'm hoping you had a wonderful day. You know, it's Monday and I hope you had a good weekend. So, um yeah. Okay, I want to deepen this purple shade, so I'm going to go in with the darker purple, and I just want to deepen it more so on the outer V. So, um, that's where I'm going to concentrate that. So, if there are videos that you all would like to see me um, produce, you know, just go ahead and leave that in the comment section and I will work on that. Wow, have you all seen the um, finale of Power? I tell you, I just wasn't expecting all of that, you know, to happen. Especially in the episode, you know, right before the end where 50 Cent kills his son. Wow. Well, Kanan kills his son, Sean. So now I'm going to use this on the lid as well as in the brow bone for my brow bone highlight. Yep. <laughs> and... And Angela and Ghost, oh my God. I can't believe, you know, with with everything and the way she acted and everything, her um 
going back to ghosts, you know. She must really love him. She must really love him. So... And how about next season, you know, they're pitting Ghost against Tommy. I mean, Tommy against Ghost. And he's not going to know what is happening. And Ghost killing all of those people in the last episode. Wow. So, yeah, I'm going to take a little bit of that transition shade and go back over here and blend this out some because I have some harsh edges and I'm using a blending brush. So once again, it's, it's blending, blending, blending. Now, I've been watching, you know, Love and Hip Hop Atlanta, and um, I'm, I'm glad the season is over with, so... From what I seen, um, you know, previews from the reunion, you know, Stevie J and Jocelyn are, are still together. So, I wonder what, you know, happened with him asking Mimi to move to California. So, and Mama D and, you know, her wedding, I, I thought they were going to do a, um, a spinoff you know, with that, the way that, um, you know, it was going, so, I have some fallout, so I, I'm just cleaning that up. Um, okay, um, so now... I'm going to put on, um, I'm going to line my eyes and I think I'm going to do a wing. So, yeah, I think I'm going to do a wing.
And speaking of Love and Hip Hop Atlanta, Kadia, oh my God, she is crazy. I I didn't know she was that crazy. But do you think her and Jock would, you know, get back together? After, you know, that incident and stuff like that. So. And Jock. I think he really loves her. But. I think she's just too much woman for him. Because she she's independent and And, you know, she has her own and she really, you know, doesn't need Jock. So, she was taking care of him, so. So, she's pretty much, you know, an independent woman. So, and she, you know, showed that she really doesn't need Jock. So, and, you know, all of his drama that comes with him. So, oh, I'm sorry. I just... Line my eyes with the NYC liquid liner. And right now I'm using um, the CoverGirl, the Super Sizer um, mascara. So, um, now I'm going to, um, put on my lashes, like, off camera, and I will be right back. Okay, now I'm going to take that deep purple and smoke out the, you know, my waterline. And I'm concentrating this on the outside. I think I'm going to bring that in just a bit. And 
and I'm going to take that color that I use for the brow bone and my lid color and put that on the inside of the waterline right here. Okay, and for my inner tear duct, I am going to use this color right here. And I think I'm going to bring that out into my waterline. So I'm going to take the color that I used as my transition color, this one right here, and I'm going to just blend that. Now I'm going to use um, this Silk Is Me by L'Oreal liner and I'm going to put that in my waterline. I already have small eyes and um, using that in the waterline would just make them seem a little, you know, make them smaller, but I like using it in the waterline. So now I'm going to use um, the Telescopic Shopping Shocking Extensions Mascara by L'Oreal on my lower lashes. It has a smaller brush than the CoverGirl. And I need to apply my highlight. And so I think I'm going to use uh, 
this color out of the Missy Lynn palette. And I'm placing that at the highest points of my cheek. And I'm going to take a little and put it on the tip of my nose. And um, I'm going to bring you out so that you can see the full face. And um, yeah. This is the first time doing a video like this, so bear with me. <laughs> And this is my ColourPop um, lippy, and it's hard. It's hard on. Plus, Woo. and now um, the Urban Decay Makeup Setting Spray. This is the All Nighter. And that is my finished look. This is the eye look. This is what the finished look looks like. And once again, I would like to thank you all for watching this video. And thank you to my new subscribers as well as my old subscribers, all of my subscribers. I thank you for supporting me. So, um, take care, be well, and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye.